Well, in less than an hour, Norfolk School Board is expected to make a very important announcement. Could it be that Dr. Richard Bentley is leaving his post as superintendent? That's a question we've been asking for the past 24 hours. We've been spent the whole day working to find out. Melanie Woodrow is now live outside that meeting. Melanie? Yeah, Tom, those school board members have been inside discussing this issue for two hours now. Superintendent Dr. Richard Bentley has not. With a security guard nearby, school board members arrived. I can't say anything. Those that did say something wouldn't say whether or not Superintendent Dr. Richard Bentley was ending his school year early. Where are all these rumors coming from? I don't, I've been out of town for the last two days. I don't know. Is this a bad idea if he leaves after being a couple months into the school year? What, what would that mean for Thanks Norfolk schools? For all you do for freedom, I really couldn't answer. Thank you so much. This afternoon, school board members entered a closed door meeting without Dr. Bentley. If he does leave, Dr. Bentley would be exiting a four year contract after 14 months. Thomas Calhoun, president of the Norfolk Federation of Teachers, worries Dr. Bentley's potential departure could hurt Norfolk schools. Two months into the school year, Either they should have done this during the summer, let someone start fresh, in my opinion, or wait to June and let someone start fresh. The Norfolk School Board has dealt with lots of issues lately. Ten of 45 Norfolk schools missed full accreditation. Lafayette Winona Middle School was denied two years in a row. Last year, Virginia found fault with how standards of learning tests were given in some Norfolk schools. And recently, school security officers pepper sprayed students to break up fights. Norfolk City Council member Andy Protegiru. The council's been kept in the dark as the citizens have been. This has really been a school board issue. And as far as we know, no council members here tonight and also to our knowledge, we have not seen Dr. Richard Bentley here at all this evening. Now, they are telling us that there's going to be some type of announcement following the 7 o'clock open session. We're expecting that we could hear whether or not that announcement involves Dr. Bentley, whether or not he will stay on as superintendent. We've also been told that they will be taking questions from the media following that announcement. My colleague Jason Marks is upstairs inside right now. He'll have the latest for you coming up tonight on Wavy News 10 at 11. And of course, updates on wavy.com always. Reporting live in Norfolk, Melanie Woodrow, 10 on your side. All right, we'll look forward to hearing more about it. Thanks, Melanie.